On April 1st, 2017, the new Dragon Ball Super storyline was announced, the Social Survival Arc. Kidding aside, this is simply an April Fool's joke by Toei, but what if this was turned into an actual arc after the Tournament of Power? This is my Dragon Ball Super Social Survival Arc pitch. So after Goku and his friends return to Earth, Chi Chi nags them about getting a job, and even though Goku works as a farmer, it isn't the best paying job by any stretch of the imagination. The introduction episode is spent with Goku going to his friends asking what type of job he should get to earn more money. We can see Goku perform several odd jobs as he goes around to his friends. For instance, Goku would travel to Krillin's police station and go out on a mission with him. I'd imagine this Goku finding a job section of the arc would take up one to two episodes. In episode 3 of the mini arc, he finally decides to go home and when he does, it appears that Chi Chi has already sorted out a job interview for Goku at the most un-Goku like place imaginable, an office building. Goku would show up very confused on what to say or do at this interview, and this would lead to some comedic moments throughout the pitch. If I were to compare the scene to another one in the franchise, I guess this interview would have the most similarities to Gohan's parent school interview in the beginning of Dragon Ball Z Movie 8, although more stretched out in this case. My pitch for the social survival arc will continue with Goku getting the job through means that... Hell, I don't even know, and I'm writing this fucking thing. Goku just wins over the employees, I guess. His first day on the job is much like Homer Simpson at the power plant. He's useless. I'm not attempting to insult Goku's intelligence or the integrity of this character in this arc, as he even brings friends along to help out with the job, aka the other Universe 7 team members, and they even fuck up with ordinary job activities. All of those mundane events have some comedic value when a character is radically unique to that situation, and the Dragon Ball characters are certainly unique, alright? Eventually, through teamwork and dedication, they actually survive a work week with a paycheck for Goku. Unfortunately, due to the damage done around the office while the Universe 7 members were failing at their work tasks, the paycheck was reduced to only a few zenny to cover for the damages. Goku talks to Chi Chi about this and then she comes around and says I guess Goku will never change and instead of getting a real job for money, he goes to the 28th Tenkeiji Budokai in a few years. Goku agrees, and instead of thinking about the money, he thinks about fighting the reincarnation Oob that Dende was talking about earlier before the Tournament of Power. The arc ends with Goku smiling, eager to participate against Oob, passing the torch on to the next generation of fighters. A key component to making this mini arc work is that it should directly contrast with the Tournament of Power. The tournament was action heavy and intense, while this social survival mini arc will be more slice of life based and extremely mundane. Although the characters will make those mundane tasks into interesting activities. Throughout the Dragon Ball Super anime and manga, some of my favorite moments are when characters are doing something ordinary, but the Dragon Ball characters are Dragon Ball characters, so wacky scenes ensue. What do you guys think about my social survival arc pitch? What would you like to see Goku and Ko do if they were actually in an office building working? I intentionally made this pitch not very in depth because this is more of a community based discussion about what you would want if this arc actually came into fruition. Please rate, comment and subscribe and I'll see you later.